Hello, how to solve this exponential problem? This is 5 power n plus 1 equals negative 25. We are solving for the value of x that satisfies this equation. So, if you have a power x plus y, this equals a power x times a power y. Applying this right here, I have 5 power n times 5 power 1 equals negative 25. So right now, I need to isolate 5 power n. I divide this by 5. I divide this by 5. So what happens here is that this cancel this. I have 5 power n equals negative 25 divided by 5. That's negative 5. So from here, I will simply express this, this negative 5 here, as product of negative 1 times 5. So I have 5 power n equals negative 1 times 5. That is negative 5. So, what I'm going to do will be to apply natural log of natural log of 5 power n equals natural log of negative 1 times 5. So, if you have natural log of a power p, equals p times natural log a, applying that here, we have n times natural log of 5, equals natural log of negative 1 times 5. Also, if you have natural log of a times b, this equals natural log a plus natural log b. Applying this right here, we have n times natural log 5 equals natural log negative 1 plus natural log 5. Now from here, if you recall these property of complex numbers, if you have square root of negative 1, this equals i. If I take the squares, this eliminate this, I have negative 1 equals i power 2. Applying this right here, I have n times natural log 5, equals natural log uh, negative 1 is i power 2. Then we have plus natural log 5. And also remember, if you have natural log a power p, this equals p times natural log a. That means n times natural log 5 equals 2 times natural log i plus natural log 5. So, the next step will be for us to simply factor it out. I'm looking for the equation now. So, we factor it out because, or we can simply isolate n by dividing this by natural log 5. And we divide this by natural log 5. This eliminates this. So, I have n equals 2 times natural log 5 plus natural log 5 divided by natural log 5. So we can divide each of these by natural log 5. I have n equals the term natural log i divided by natural log 5 plus natural log 5 divided by natural log 5. So right now, this eliminate this, that gives us what? So I have n equals 2 times natural log i divided by natural log 5 plus 1. And don't forget the fact that if you have natural log a divided by natural log b equals natural log a to the place of b. 
So we have n equals 2 times natural log i to the base of 5 plus 1. So this is it. This is it, guys. Let's make use of another approach to solve this exponential problem. So if we consider this other approach, that means we have 5 power n plus 1 equals negative 25, meaning if you have a power x plus y, this equals a power x times a power y. That means we have 5 power n times 5 power 1 equals negative 25. We divide this by 5, we divide this by 5. This cancel this. I have 5 power n because this is negative 5. I consider this other identity. But before then, let's express this as product of negative 1 times 5. A 5 power n equals negative 1 times 5. I apply log or natural log. Like natural log of 5 power n equals natural log of negative 1 times 5. So remember, Natural log a times b equals natural log b plus natural log b. And also, natural log a power b equals b times natural log b. Applying these two properties right here, so we have n times natural log 5 equals natural log negative 1 plus natural log 5. And remember, if you have e power i times pi plus 1 equals 0, meaning e power i times pi equals negative 1. So, inserting that here, we have n times natural log 5 equals natural log e power i times pi plus natural log 5. So, Remember this other property, natural log a power b equals b times natural log a. Applying that here, i pi comes behind this, of n times natural log a equals i times pi times natural log a plus natural log 5. So from here, this cancel this, of n times natural log 5 equals i times pi plus natural log 5. So, to solve for n, I divide this by natural log 5. I divide this by natural log 5. This eliminate this. I have n equals i times pi plus natural log 5 divided by natural log 5. So, from here, I have n equals i times pi divided by natural log 5 plus natural log 5, divided by natural log 5. This cancel this. And from here we have n equals i times pi, divided by natural log 5, plus 1. This also is a valid solution, guys. So, this answer and this answer here, they are absolutely correct. Just that, here we have i pi, and here we have Two times natural log i, which is the same thing. So, i pi equals two times natural log i. So, guys, that is it. And this is how you solve this exponential problem. Don't forget to subscribe and share. Thank you and goodbye.